Hello everyone, it's me Ramon from Avilite Studios and we want to make uh, an unboxing of Curse Castilla X PlayStation 4 Limited Edition. It could be one of the products we are most proud of because it has been a good work from a lot of people and I think that the people is really excited with this because uh, well it's a limited edition and it has been run out so if you want to find one you have to be really careful because uh, could be that you can follow us in the twitter and we will give some of them, them because we have fewer units but if not you have to buy it and you had to buy it before because now it is sold out so Cures Castilla X for PlayStation 4 comes from the original uh, Maldita Castilla for PC and in the original version uh, Locomalito made some really limited edition handcrafted because he wanted to do and we wanted to make something similar so we wanted to make something similar for consoles and in this case uh, we have done Cures Castilla X limited edition with the people from Stasisoft and we have sold them in PlayAsia PlayAsia is a well-known uh, website about video games so we are going to open it and you are going to see the secrets of Cures Castilla X for PlayStation. So this is the box and you can see, uh, could be it's difficult for you because of the, of the video, but you can see that the letters are embossed, so it's something really, really nice to see and really we have take, took a lot of care with this, glory, the glory of the arcade times. We are going to open it, so it's a important moment in the life. This is a sample edition because, uh, as we are the developers, they have sent us a sample edition, and, and there is one difference between this and the, and the official limited edition. This is the box you can see with the names of Tokomalito, Grisor, Avilite, and Estasia Soft. This is the this is for Asian countries, but you know, for PlayStation 4 you can use it in, in every platform. And this is the only uh, edition that had that has English, Japanese and, and manual. I'm going to open it with curl. In the inside we can find several things. One is the box of the game. That is more or less limited too because it's really important. This is the certificate number limited edition. As you can see, there is sample. Instead of a number, we have the sample edition. It's the, the letters are embossed too. For the glory of the arcade time, thanks for your support. This is the soundtrack. It has been a, a really effort from us to make the the soundtrack because there are a lot of songs you can see that there are uh, 56 uh, songs and it has been hard to to put these big songs in a cd but uh, alberto has done a really good job with with javier with grizor and we are really proud of uh, uh, putting all the songs in the cd there are songs in spanish and other in english And nothing more inside, but there is there are important things inside the, the CD. But you can see the in the outside of the box the screenshots that has have been took with a lot of care too. The game has a 12 plus rating in China or Asia, I don't know exactly. Hong Kong is China. And the letters are this is always Something hard to do. Oh my god. This is like easy opening, but it's never easy opening. And I would always do the same like this. It's a really unboxing. Okay. So we have it. Inside there is the most valuable, the most valuable thing that is the manual. You know that now 
usually um, in video games they don't include manuals and we wanted to make something really important so, so yeah here the, the manual with the story the bestiary so you can see here enemies but anim animals the dead and the dead fantastic creatures guardians and demons the realm of pain Craftmena, Tolomera. Here you can see Eva Gaspar, Miguel Corchero, Alberto, Ramon Nafria, that it's me, Carlos Corella, Nilo Lasso, Carlos Olivier, Ju Untoglu, Heavy Stilus, Telgaris, Alexei, Kubrov, and Robert, Robert Egelnest, Canuk, Roman Empress, Nacho Garcia, Ricardo Fernandez, Mendy, Geth, Community, and you for playing. So this is the manual. So, normal DVD for PlayStation 4. We can open these two. Let's see if it is easy. We will need help. It seems it's harder. Okay, I think I will get this. Yes, Give me a point of help. I will move the world. Original soundtrack by Peter 87. So this is the soundtrack. It's pretty nice. It's like a Mano Art album. But it's Cubes Castilla. Soundtrack bonus. We have, uh, well, Grithor uh, Javier used the Sound of FM chip Yamaha 2203. So the music with this own blood and magically did it to exceed the sound quality of the arcade, arcade music. So this is something really, really special. And that's all for now, my friends. So thank you for watching, and it will be a pleasure to listen to your comments about this. Have a nice day.